Where was I? 11th grade, history class. Silence. No acknowledgement of the event. Class all day. Parents of Boston children ushered out of the classroom. Will I lose my freedom? Senior photography class. Someone ran in and yelled simply that a plane had crashed into a building. We didn't understand. We just kept on working. Someone else came in and explained to us shocked students. I still didn't believe it after watching it a hundred times. How will our lives change? I will never forget freshman year of college, Communications 101, my most lively class, in an instant dead with silence. What will happen to my country? I remember halfway through my 10th grade geometry class, an administrator walked in and announced that a plane had been flown into the World Trade Centers. TVs were on for the rest of the day. A few days later, President Bush requested support for the War on Terror. Would we lose our freedom? Women and girls are not permitted to work outside the home. All women who are obliged to leave their homes must be accompanied by a mahram, their father, brother, or husband. Women and girls will wear the chaudhry. Women and girls are forbidden to wear brightly colored clothes beneath the chaudhry. No male physicians may touch the body of a woman under the pretext of a medical examination. A girl is not allowed to converse with a young man. Infraction of this law will lead to the immediate marriage of the offenders. Muslim families are not allowed to listen to music, even during a wedding. Families are not allowed to photograph or videotape anything, even during a wedding. Muslim families may not give non-Islamic names to their children. When the police punish an offender, no one is allowed to ask a question or complain. All those who break the laws of Sharia must be punished in the public square. I will do more than pray, because when the last Talib has put away his black turban and I can be a free woman in a free Afghanistan, I will take up my life there once more and do my duty as a citizen, as a woman, and I hope as a mother.